Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, let's go over when you flip the signs with inequalities and why you do this. Let's begin with this example. Okay, we have 1 is less than 2, which is true. However, if we multiply both sides by negative 3, we get the following. Negative 3 times 1 is negative 3 less than negative 3 times 2 is negative 6. Notice that negative 3 is not less than negative 6. Okay, so we need to, in order for it to be correct, we need to flip the signs. Okay, so we will apply the same thing to some inequalities. Let's work a couple examples and then one where you will not flip the sign. Okay, let's begin with this. We need to get x isolated. So we're going to begin with subtracting both sides by 6. So 6 from 6, these cancel. We have a negative 5 x is greater than or equal to, and 21 minus 6 is 15. Remember, whenever you subtract a positive and negative, you take the sign of the larger number. Now we have a negative 5x. To undo multiplication, we need to divide. So we're going to divide both sides by negative 5. Okay? So now these cancel. We have x and since we're dividing by a negative number, we're going to flip the sign and then negative, excuse me, 15 divided by negative 5 is negative 3. So there we go. That's example 1. Now I have this example because in this example, uh, you do not flip the sign because you, well, let's, let's solve it and I'll talk. Okay. We have a division. We need to get n by itself, so we have a division. So we're going to multiply each side by 5. Okay? These cancel. The n comes down, and it's less than uh, negative 5 times 5. Now, you are not multiplying or dividing each side by a negative number. Just because you have a negative number over here on this side, do not flip the sign because, again, it's not a negative number number that you're multiplying or dividing. It's a positive. So this does become negative. 25 would be the answer, and the sign stays the same. Let's work one more example where we do flip the sign. Okay, often you'll encounter something like this. Again, let's get x by itself. We have um, division, so we're going to multiply each side by negative 4. Okay, these cancel, bring down the x. Again, we are multiplying by a negative number, so we're going to flip the sign, okay, and so 5 times negative 4 is negative 20, okay. So again, I hope this helps in figuring out when you flip the sign with inequalities. Remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.